Hey crew, today's video will be a strawberry poke cake. And here are the ingredients we'll be using. We have strawberry shake pudding, one stick of unsalted butter, cool whip, strawberries, strawberry pie filling, strawberry supreme cake mix, we have milk, and we have eggs. If you like to see this full video, please stay tuned. Don't forget to like and comment on the video. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, please do so. And click the bell and set post notifications to all. Let's get into our strawberry poke cake. Okay, so we're gonna get started on our strawberry poke cake. And y'all can use whatever brand of strawberry cake you want to. And you can follow the directions on the back of the box if you want to. But I'm going to do this a little different. I'm going to go in with three eggs, one cup of milk, and a half a stick of melted butter. But the box requires one cup of water, three eggs, and a half a cup of vegetable oil. So we're going to kind of do it our way. Also in the comment section below, let us know how y'all been doing and what y'all been up to. One cup of milk. Three eggs. And make sure you hold the shells. Nobody wanna have no shells in them cake. Oh, if y'all don't know, I'm a strawberry cake lover, whether it's homemade or box made. It's one of my favorite cakes, hands down. Besides red velvet, caramel cake. You can never go wrong with a strawberry cake, I promise you. So we're going to go in with one stick of unsalted butter. We're simply going to give it a mix. Okay, so we're gonna move to the next step. We'll put that right there. We're gonna take our pan. And that's a little butter right there that I spilled from when I melted the butter. But hey, it'll be okay. They're gonna be one. We're gonna add Baker's Joy. And we simply just gonna add our batter. We're gonna flip it. Okay, so we have our cake batter evenly distributed in our pan. I'm going to put it in the oven at 350 degrees and bake it until a toothpick inserted in the center comes out clean. Or you can simply just follow the box direction. Okay, cool. So I have the strawberry cake out the oven and I have it on a cooling rack. And it took 40 minutes to bake at 350 degrees. But hey, had to make sure that it was completely done. So I let the cake cool off completely and now we're going to poke holes in it because don't forget it's our strawberry poke cake. Alright so we got our holes poked in our cake. We're going to go in with one pack of our strawberry shake. So we're going to go in with two cups of milk. And we're just going to mix it slowly for one minute. So we have our pud mix and we're simply just going to pour this over our cake. And we're gonna put it in the refrigerator for two to three hours and allow it to completely set in.
Okay, cool. So we allow our cake to sit in the refrigerator. So our um, strawberry shake pudding can set. And as you see, it has set in very nicely. So we're gonna move on to the next step. This is one 21 ounce can of strawberry pie filling or topping. All right, so we got our strawberry topping slash pie filling on top of our strawberry poke cake. We're gonna put it back in the refrigerator and allow it to chill for probably 30 minutes to an hour. So I'm gonna give y'all a famous close-up real quick. Here's that famous close-up. So we let our strawberry poke cake sit in the refrigerator. So our strawberry filling can set on our cake. Now I'm gonna go in with some Cool Whip and I'm using extra creamy. Okay, so now we got our Cool Whip evenly spread it on top of our strawberry poke cake. We're gonna go in with some fresh strawberries. Okay, so we're just simply gonna put our strawberries on top. Okay, somebody get y'all that famous close up. Okay, Crusoe, just our strawberry oat cake, and I'm gonna cut into it. Then we're gonna let when you give it a try. So I'm gonna kind of turn this a little bit. So I can give it a, a crooked cut. Cause I ain't nothing straight about that. See the pudding in there? And then Okay, crew, so we got our taste test about to go down, and we're gonna start with David Girl, and her mom's gonna give it a try. Okay, now step back. she tasting it, she take a long time. Baby says she gonna get it, man. She ain't gonna play. You can taste um, the strawberry pudding in it. Uh -huh. 
It's real good. And it's not sweet. It's the perfect amount. Um, the perfect amount of everything. Of texture, softness, sweetness, moisture. The integrity. I don't think that's thing. <laughs> you don't? But it's good. What you think about it? It tastes like a crumb cake. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's what it, t- it reminds you of, a crumb cake. And you eat crumb cake. I don't eat no cream. Oh. Okay, but what you think about the overall cake itself? Finger licking gut. Finger licking gut. And baby still going in. <laughs> oh, you don't get copyrighted for that. That's, a, that's insane. That's insane. No, nah, I ain't worried about getting copyrighted for that. Mm-hmm. It's, um, it's delicious. Really Can I have the strawberry? Sure. <laughs> I'm about to go in. Greedy spirit activated. Mm. I think you need to make this Mm-mm-mm. for upcoming engagements and receptions. Yeah, like when I move out. Because everybody will be able to eat this, even Miss Cynthia. You can make it for Easter. It's good. Yeah, make that for Easter. Y'all, I appreciate y'all for watching. Please don't forget to like and comment on the video. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. Click the bell, set post notifications to all. That way you're notified when I upload a video. And y'all already know the saying, pops out. Cool it is.